Hello and welcome to a new video about digital technology. We are talking about codes now. We heard about numbering systems. Right now I have noted decimal number system, binary number system and hexadecimal numbering system. However, a combination of bits, a combination of zeros and one must not necessarily be, in, be binary. Yeah? One code is the so-called binary coded decimal number. Yeah? We have seen that in the and there's a strong relation between four digits binary to one digit hexadecimal. Here I've noted already, what I also want to show you now is how easy you can just write down a binary combination, all possible binary combinations, okay? Starting with the left, with the left digit, uh, the right digit, you simply change every time here. So you say zero, one, zero, one, 0 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 okay every time you change and next digit every two times you change yeah you say 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 and then every four yeah every double yeah Zero 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 one 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 zero 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 one 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 and then every eight yeah so zero 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 one 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 sounds stupid if you do it I suggest to do it in your head eh? and not speak it out loud. <laughs> uh, yeah, but then it just gives you this table eh? and it's working. Perfect. We've seen, ha, ah, it's very nice. It's very nice that we have a one-to-one -one relation that f a pack of four binary numbers is exactly one hexadecimal number. And Somebody said, hey, but I'm not used to using hexadecimal, I'm used to use decimal. Yeah? So why not do that? Yeah? Why not just map one decimal digit to a pack of four bits? Done. Okay? This is binary coded decimal number. So this means I'm just quitting here. My table, I just quit the table here. So I'm only using those combinations and this is my binary coded number yeah only these combinations are used yeah and we are changing one digit after the other. Yeah? One decimal digit is transferred after the other. Yeah? So for instance, if we would have a decimal number, let's use, I don't know, 47, uh, 47 decimal. Then we're using every digit, yeah? We're using every digit, so 4 is 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, yeah? So that's it, yeah? It's 0, 1, 0, 0, that's 4, yeah? And 7 is 0, 1, 1, 1. And this is B, C, D. I don't care about other combinations. I don't care at all. Yeah? I'm just using these packs of four bits yeah? and say, okay, I'm doing it like I would be hexadecimal. Yeah? Those things here, these, these combinations, I, w I need to store this, yeah? so I need the four bits, yeah? and I'm losing 
this yeah lost maybe i could use them as some sort of you know error indication or something like this if i don't only want to display numbers so, so okay, there was an error measurement error or overflow error underflow error and so on and so on could be possible yeah however just by using the pcd just by using only a part of the combinations we are losing quite some yeah? and i don't know if you would have a pcd number uh, yeah, let's one zero zero one zero one zero one uh, pcd you simply, you simply do it one by one so one zero one zero zero one is nine so this is nine and one zero one zero one is five so that's 95 yeah if i would in decimal and now to show you that the difference yeah if this would be a binary number huh? then the values would be, I mean, this is the value 1, this is the value 2, this is the value 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 128. We would reach 128 plus 16 plus 4 plus 1. So this means we are getting, this is 20, 21, 29 149 the same combination does mean something totally different and this is why it is important to know the code huh yeah? 95 or one and, and look it's the same it's the same combination yeah this is why we write we write this down PCT and bin for instance yeah? yeah and this is also indicating with the same amount of, of digits I can use I can I can display simply more numbers uh, if I'm using the binary system however I'm losing this one by one translation hmm? one thing which is also uh, coming or let's see how many bits are changing let's see how many bits are changing if we change from one digit to the next here we are changing one not this here this is changing this is changing two are changing here one is changing here three are changing here how many one here this is changing, this is changing, two are changing. Here, one is changing. Here, four are changing. This is changing, this, everything is changing. So there is a lot of change going on in the bit patterns. So, okay, I don't care. Yeah. However, if you do a false reading by a measurement device or something like this, let's imagine this bit is, is, is off. Yeah. This bit, I don't read a zero, yeah? I read a one. Yeah? So and this combination is five and this combination is 13. Wow. Yeah? Or it might happen, for instance, I'm reading those three bits yeah? and then accidentally not this, but the neighbor bit. Yeah? Because I, I'm a little bit tilted. Yeah? And suddenly I have not, I'm not reading seven, I'm reading 15. That's far off. That's far off. Huh? This is the reason why on measurement devices where this maybe is somehow marked on the ruler and I have to read them, physically read it, yeah, uh, there is often a code used which is called gray code. Huh? What a gray code is and how it's the usual gray code is working, I'm going to explain in next video. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.